UK tech pioneers have shaped the world we live in and are now shaping the future. As a truly global nation, the UK's head start on competitors extends far beyond its historic role in the first industrial revolution. The UK has developed a startling array of incredible scale-ups and unicorns. Foundational sectors like AI and robotics have created knock-on effects for other tech sectors like EdTech, Net Zero and Health Tech. Global leadership in a host of industries beckons. The maturity of the UK tech economy is valued and respected globally, drawing serious levels of investment from overseas. International funding represented 63% of venture capital investment in the UK, rising year on year since 2016. A healthy tech ecosystem and deep-rooted sector strengths have created an abundance of extremely well-grounded, market-ready propositions. Such substantial investments saw the creation of several new unicorns in 2020, and they're spread across an incredible variety of sectors – Octopus Energy, Arrival, Gymshark and Hopin. Eight months after launching, Hopin, an online events platform, became the UK's fastest ever double unicorn in November 2020. Founder and CEO of Hopin, Johnny Burfahat, is in no doubt that setting up in the UK set Hopin on the path to success from day one. Being a UK-based scale-up has provided a lot of extra opportunity for us. The entire culture is built towards thinking globally, which is really, really impactful for us because we had customers in the US on day one and there's people that speak different languages that you can hire on day one. There's a lot more product talent in the UK. There's a ton of advantages for being based in London and, and being based in the UK as a whole. The serious potential of UK-based scale-ups has been recognised and seized upon by overseas investors. Deep Tech, an umbrella under which AI, robotics, blockchain, biotech and quantum computing sit, has seismic levels of disruptive potential. Streetbees, a scale-up that applies deep learning AI to consumer behaviour, was growing at a rapid rate before the pandemic struck. As traditional market research methods became impossible, the level of insights Streetbees generates was perfectly demonstrated and they are now growing faster than ever before. We observe real-life moments in consumers' lives when they are eating, drinking, in a pub or shaving in the morning and we keep all of data in a single database. You are talking about billions and billions of data points. This is all unstructured data sitting in a data lake. When a business needs to understand why are people shaving less all of a sudden, you know, because of the pandemic, our natural language understanding technology allows us to be able to recut the data, reinterpret this existing database to be able to answer very specific business questions. As tech continues to disrupt and innovate across ever wider latitudes, the UK's capacity and inclination to lead in vital sectors of the economy is clear. Four-time Olympian Dr Ian Percy has seized on the UK's skills and expertise in advanced manufacturing to establish Artemis Technologies, a company that designs zero-emission maritime vessels that use hydrofoils, effectively underwater wings that reduce drag to fly over the water. Ian saw how digital twinning, computer models that simulate the impact of small design tweaks on vessel performance which save years of testing and decarbonize the maritime industry faster. The thing with new technology to solve the climate crisis, it's going to have to be new transformative tech. So digital twinning is even more important because you've got to spread a wider net and look at greater solutions. So in the time we could build one prototype of a vessel with our digital twin, we could look at millions of different solutions and then home in and then within a year you've checked millions of paths to, against millions of business models to look at the best way to solve the problem either for the consumer or for the environment. The knock-on effects of being a mature tech economy are remarkable. Expertise and advances in one sector lead to advances in another, creating a truly dynamic economy. Just as Artemis uses a simulator to iterate and test engineering breakthroughs, 
benevolent AI used deep learning to trawl through data, journals and papers to find existing solutions for diseases. The rich tech ecosystem in the UK has allowed cross-pollination within their team to deliver amazing results. We think collaboration is key. We deliver data in rapid feedback loop and iterate our models to achieve results that were once unimaginable. And that purely comes from collaboration with scientists, technologists and engineers all working together to solve complex problems in record time. In a year like no other, the transformative impact of technology has been tested and found to have surpassed expectations. Society has embraced technology. Its role and function in the economy is fundamental to the global recovery from the slump brought about by COVID-19. As the world grapples with what follows, the UK's historic strength in research-led innovation, advanced manufacturing and fintech leaves it poised and primed to create and shape the future of tech.